forecast with meteorologist Jackson Chastain starts now. Oh, it was a rainy and drizzly day today, and that was to be expected. Ophelia making its way up to the north, and as it does so, keeping things damp in the mid-state. And uh, thankfully, I know the uh, Penn State whiteout game happened. Didn't look that bad from what I saw on TV, so that, that was great news there. I know some folks were kind of worried about a washout. Stuff like that did not look like that happened. Of course, I think one of the uh, – there's kind of two big points with what happened today. Number one, uh, it kept us kind of cool outside. In fact, uh, we didn't really warm beyond 60, 61 – and we only hit 61 in Harrisburg today. Uh, that has made for what has been probably one of the coolest days we've seen since May. And uh, really across the area, some of us didn't even break 60. And I mentioned that this morning. Lebanon, New York. Uh, Lebanon, New York uh, sitting in the upper 50s, of course. I mean, that is just incredible uh, for a September day. I mean, considering the fact that we were sitting in the 70s just a few days ago, uh, that shift is very apparent. And uh, it just it made for a very fall like day. Today was the first day and is the first day of calendar fall. And uh, it was a pretty good one other than the rain. Of course, as Ophelia continues to make its way up to the north, it's going to bring us more rounds of showers. Now it's weakened a little bit. It's no longer a tropical storm and it's a tropical depression at this point. But that really has no effect on us because you're never looking at seeing any impact from winds anyways. We were expecting a lot of this rain to continue, and that's exactly what we're seeing there. Uh, that track continuing to hook off to the right into places like New Jersey. Not going to make its way directly over the mid-state, but you're still going to see the effect of some of these bands as this system makes its way to the north and to the east. And timing that out, really, uh, there's not a whole lot of science to this. It's pretty much throughout the day we're expecting to see all of this rain. So just keep a raincoat handy, and uh, pretty much uh, you can expect... Throughout most hours, there's going to be rain falling. Now, once you get into the morning hours, Monday, things start to clear out dramatically, and that's when we expect to really, really dry out. But, um, you know, kind of a drizzly day Sunday. Rest of the week, very nice weather, sitting in the 70s by the time we get to next weekend. Looking forward to that weekend, I would say, Taylor, uh, we got some nice fall weather coming up. All right, I'm sure Allie Bruby is wishing for some nice fall weather for right sure. now. Yeah. She is live at Beaver Stadium. Let's send it over to her. Allie, how's it going?